What's going on, Fume Hands? And how did you like my new badass intro? <laughs> uh, I absolutely love it. And I have to send out a huge thank you to Tom Thays uh, for making that for me. He was the original creator of my logos, like this one. And yesterday, he sent that over to me on Facebook. And I'm like, Damn, <laughs> love it. I cannot thank you enough. So awesome, man. And I thought I was doing well with my new Power Director 12. <laughs> and then you had to go and make that for me, and I'm like, damn. <laughs> uh, this way surpasses what I've been doing, so I absolutely love it. So thanks a million, Tom. Now, let's get on to... Today's scent, day 18 of the Sephora Challenge, where I wear a different fragrance every day in the month of December from Sephora and report back daily my thoughts on the fragrance. And I'm kind of keeping it down. Everybody's asleep. Amanda's trying to sleep right here. <laughs> I don't know how she's going to do it. Uh, oh, I just saw her peek her eyes open. Hey, say hi. Uh, I told her this was going to happen. Uh, this was the challenge, and there was going to be times like this where I needed to shoot. So, uh, let's get this done. Mont Blanc Legend is the scent for today. And what do I think? Uh, for me, this one, I don't hate it, but I don't absolutely love it. It's just all right. Uh, <laughs> with that being said, people flipped at work today. Ladies loved it. Yep. Everybody loves it. <laughs> what, do you, what do you mean, yep, everybody loves it? At, yep. your, at your work? Yep, everybody loves it. Yeah, there, there was a girl today at work that absolutely loved it, too. Oh, well, lots of them, but one of them was like, damn, you know? Uh, I don't know. I guess it has that factor that people love. So that's great, you know? Uh, if you're looking for something like that, well... Of course, a lot, of, a lot of you are, but frankly, I want to enjoy it myself, too. So I want to find something like that. Uh, if I was looking for a compliment getter, I want to find something like that that I also love. Me personally, I don't really love this myself. The overall feeling of it is just kind of like a, a soapy detergent kind of feel. Uh, with a slight creaminess there from Tonka and Sandalwood. What you have in here at the base is a slight creamy woody feel from Tonka Bean and Sandalwood. And then you have lavender, or actually, I don't know, one of the sites I looked up actually referred to what's in here as lavender, which is another form of lavender, but a cheaper form used in cheap perfumes. Not my words. <laughs> That's quoted. So... And lavender, what you get out of that is kind of the same thing as lavender. You get that soapy, detergent, dryer sheet kind of feel. And that's what you have in this fragrance. And I do get the pineapple for a little bit at the top, which is nice because I am a huge pineapple fan. I love my pineapple. Uh, but that doesn't really, that doesn't stay too long. Maybe a couple minutes, maybe five. And then after that, it's just, uh, that's, that, it is pleasing. It is smooth. There's a little bit of floral there from Jasmine there as well. Uh, it is smooth. It is pleasing. I mean, it's... I don't know. It's kind of like doing your laundry. It smells fresh and clean. <laughs> so, it, it, it doesn't really over-excite me too much, but obviously the ladies <laughs> love it. At least in my world. So that's good. Amanda. It's because we do the laundry so much that we love that stuff. That's probably why ladies love it. Because they, they, they love the, doing the laundry. Right. It's you love doing it, right? No, not really. <laughs> Come on. No. But that's what they're, they're born with, the clean smell of laundry. And it gets etched in their brain. That clean stuff is good. So whatever smells like that is good. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know. There you go. Let's get into some psychology stuff. I was going to swear. Mm -hmm. In this video, I find out why women like laundered detergent smells. Maybe that's the secret to panty droppers right there. Boy, we got to dig deeper, fellas. <laughs> we got to dig deeper into the psyche of a woman. 
That's right. I don't know if we want to go there to tell you the truth. No, uh, we're, we're crazy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I love it when women can admit that. I had a lady today at work, cashier lady, this young girl, I don't know, maybe she's like 19, and she's like, women are nuts. I know that. I know I'm nuts. We're a crazy species. And I'm like, I love that. <laughs> but you gotta love them, though. The trick is finding the least crazy of them all. Sorry, ladies. Yeah. <laughs> I think a lot of people pissed. <laughs> My mom says that, too. My mom is always like, I hated working with women, Dan. I will never, ever do it ever again. Working with women sucks. They drive you nuts. Oh yeah. We're getting off a whole different little. <laughs> we're getting off a whole different tangent here. Yep. We got to get back to the review. Have you smelt this? Yep. Do you like it? It's fine. It's fine. Mm -hmm. It's fine, or is it like fine? It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. For for me, it lasts about maybe five to six hours. So longevity really isn't there for me. It does pretty well for the first couple of hours, but after that, it gets pretty weak. So, in the designer world, this one, the longevity really is kind of weak on me as well. Uh, so this one, nah, not really too excited. Sorry if you love it, that's just how it works for me. Ladies love it, so that's good. But, that is the end of day 18. Stay tuned for tomorrow, day 19, when I can be loud again. See you then.